Well guys, the Doom Mongers are getting back together like it's a throwback to 2020, but instead of bat flu, this time they're making plans for a possible bird flu pandemic. Is there any way someone could weaponize the bird flu? Yeah, this given the past few years is bloody concerning, and what makes it even worse is the fact we got scumbags who pumped out dodgy data around that one working on this one. Of course, I'm talking about Neil Ferguson, whose laughably wrong models helped bring about the start of lockdowns and literally all that followed it. How this guy still has a position in the field baffles me, but I guess when your lies help push the right narrative, they keep you on for the next one. Here, though, they write in the Telegraph, health officials are drawing up covid s modelling to see what would happen if the current bird flu pandemic evolved to be able to spread from humans to human. Let's hope they're not doing gain-of-function research to try and make it do that. It goes on, the UK HSA has now activated a new technical group to create modelling for a potential human outbreak of bird flu. The group features UK health security agencies' own experts as well as some external academics who were prominent in the COVID response. The 26-strong group includes UK Health Security Chief Advisor Professor Susan Hopkins and Imperial's Professor Neil Ferguson. Obviously, they got no Susan Mitchie this time as she works for the WHO, but I'm still sure it's full of communist scumbag like Sage was. Now, they are saying that these models are all hypothetical, so we shouldn't worry or anything like that. But remember, the models in 2020 were just possibilities. That was until the government decided to use them to lock us down. But we know they're trying to start the fear machine up again if needed, and they even mention it here. It reads, amid the backdrop of the ongoing COVID inquiry, the news of fresh modelling for a potential viral outbreak is likely to cause alarm among both the public and policy makers. No, it won't cause the public alarm, or not for anyone who ain't a wet wipe, because much of the public probably won't bloody believe ya. Yes, we got a lot of sheep, but many people now know that they got played the past few years, so won't fall for it again. Of course, the bed wet as well, but they're always gonna do that. Personally, I think all involved in what went on the past few years should be investigated and locked up, not given new jobs creating bullshit models for bird flu as we've seen here. Now, while I don't actually think anything will come from this, I will keep an eye on it, but I can tell you now, I ignored these tosspots and their crap in 2020, and I plan to do the same game forward. Where are